Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in a courtroom where a sovereign citizen has returned, this time with a lawyer. And you know what? If he's actually have got a lawyer, maybe he's actually learned a lesson in life. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. All right, this is the city of Detroit versus Michael Kenneth Lewis. Case number SP1436290, counts one, two, and three. SP1444441, counts one and counts two. SP1444551, uh, appearance for the record, please. Good, good morning, Your Honor. Gregory Moore, P34437, on behalf of Mr. Lewis. Mr. Lewis, state your name. Michael Lewis. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. I'm trying to bring in Corporal McCree for his appearance on the record. Um, this is only for today. Uh, this is only going to be trial on the latter three cases that I call. The other case is uh, dismissed. Let's see. Paul McCree, good morning to you. Uh, good morning. Can you put your appearance on the record, please? Uh, Corporal Jamie McCree, badge 2865, Detroit Police Department. Today is the victim time set for a trial. Now here, Ms. Snyder, can you put your appearance on the record, please? Good morning, Your Honor. Alexa Schneider for the People, P80322. All right. Here's the issue with this. Um, these cases, uh, the first three cases, that's for 36290, counts one, two, and three are not on the docket today. Mm. They um, are cases that were uh, allegations that were made earlier this year in March, and for some reason they weren't added, and I don't know why, but they should have been. Therefore, the same thing, unregistered, untitled, driving my license suspended, no insurance. Um, um, I do have proof of insurance and proof of registration. Um, Ms. Mr. Lewis has showed a, a driver's license issued in the state of Florida. He indicates that he needs to get these matters cleared up before he gets a Michigan license. Um, with that being said, there was an offer on the table for failure to display. What is the city's position? Uh, Your Honor, Alexa, Alexa Schneider for the People, P80322. I'd move to dismiss the insurance and the registration counts. As to the license count, is there would there be any way if he could pay a reinstatement fee and go, go get his license or maybe do some kind of conditional dismissal and have a non-reporting review date where we can review that he has his license? There's no way that I can... Um, uh, I mean, that if it were something where, where you would enter into an agreement where you would dismiss, you can either dismiss if he doesn't bring a license, I guess, and refile, or I guess we could make some kind of condition like that, but. Um, other than that, there's no way for me to check the Florida license to see if it's valid. Um, right. I, I think I've seen, I think maybe Judge Giles, I know I know some court used to do it where they would do a dismissal and have a, I think Corporal McCree has a has a statement too, but they, they would do some kind of dismissal and then they would be able, the clerks could check and make sure they had a license and if they didn't, they'd have to come back. I just want, I just want to get on the court. I don't know. 
Hold on, hold on, Mr. Glover, hold on. I'll tell you one thing. I sure do hope that I don't have to have Mr. Lewis ever again in my courtroom. Yeah, yeah, Your Honor. I can imagine why you don't want him in your courtroom because they're the most obnoxious, ill-mattered, and uneducated morons that you will ever see in your courtroom. Well, there may be others, but I'm just taking a wild guess on that they might be that way. Because he... Now, I just, I just don't, I don't want to see him in my courtroom ever again. It's a difficult person to deal with. I've been and through I'm a lot, serious. Judge, trying to, with this. I've been through a lot. Been, I don't care. Everybody's been through something. But you are one of the most worrisome persons in the world. Period. You My have apologies. A, there you want to keep on talking. Boy, this nigga out of pocket. Wait a minute. Who is this? Cage? Get out of my courtroom. Damn! That's going to be out of pocket. Where is he? It's, um, it's, uh, so. Uh, we'll just we can if, if that's something that you've seen done. I don't have a problem doing that. We'll have them back for a review date. You go to the Secretary of State. You get that license transferred over. Um, I don't know why that he can't go to the Secretary of State and just get a license now because these are merely just allegations, um, Mr. Moore. What do you have to say? I, well, I have to ask you, do you know if your client has tried to go get a valid Michigan license or not? I, I don't know that much. You, you know, I, I've been trying to help him. Uh, I know you're very reasonable, the prosecutor reasonable. I know the officer very well. I like to work out something to to resolve this myself, I'm trying to do the, doing this pro bono for him to try to help him out. So whatever we can come up with, I'm for. You know, he he he's lost his job because of that uh, strike. That was the first four, four of the first police strike. So he hasn't worked in over three weeks. All right. Your Honor, could Corporal McCree be heard? Yes, of course. Um, I ran lean yesterday, and I'm looking at it right here, and approximately at 10 a.m. Um, regarding his vehicle in question here. Uh, as of yesterday at 10 o'clock a.m., uh, the vehicle was still expired and the no insurance. Now, uh, it's possibly he could have did it after that, you know, but I just wanted to make bring that on the record. And his Mi Michigan driver's license um, was currently still suspended. Um, for some reason, I, I counted three Michigan driver's licenses, which is unheard of in my whole entire career, how one person could have three different driver licenses with the same birth date. Um, I, di I didn't... They didn't know about the Florida's driver license. I don't know if anybody ran lean, but I just wanted to bring that to your attention. Yes, sir. Well, I've I been know getting a runaround. I've been trying I, to get a license. I, uh, excuse me. I, I know uh, a couple cases with the driver's license, the police officer put the wrong name in. I, I had mentioned that this morning. The last time we well, talked to Well, I'm not necessarily concerned too much about that. I did see documentation of valid, what I what I presume to be valid registration and insurance. He's got a play, he had a plate sitting there too. I didn't take too much of a look at that, but the paperwork looked up to be uh, copacetic to me. And um, so we're just really here about uh, the um, the well, the the. 
I, I guess I'll, I'll grant a conditional dismissal. Um, we'll set a review date. Th this means, sir, that if the if the tickets um, this thing this means that if you don't come back with a valid driver's license, we're the, 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 they're gonna we're gonna the court's gonna reinstate the um, license suspended tickets. We'll dismiss the um, unregistered, untitled, no insurance for providing valid documentation. Um, How so, can I be done with everything, sir? How? Can, can I pay? What What do I need to do for? Failure to display $240. Let them pay. That's the, that's the offer. Put you in a breakout room with um, your attorney, read him his we'll, advice or face, and that'll be it. We won't even have to have him come back. We'll, we'll take that, Your Honor. Yeah. I, I guess he's going to have to now. He wanted to take it. All right. Join the breakout room, please. Many, many minutes later. Okay. Now, Mr. Uh, Corporal McCree, did you send. Uh, uh, we're off the record. Uh, did you send uh, that note to uh, Ms. Snyder as well? I think I might have sent you the note from him, Your Honor. Maybe. Okay, that's okay. Okay. So, I mean, does that matter on the on the license or anything, Mister? Let's go back on the record with Mister. Um, Michael Michael Lewis. Um, I got a, I got a note saying that your client doesn't have valid registration and insurance. Now, Mr. Corporal McCree, can you tell me how he, you know he keeps showing me these documents? All right, can you tell me how you know that or how you substantiate that? I just ran lean right now, uh, two minutes ago, on that uh, two thousand and Chevy Suburban. <laughs> Registered to Mr. Michael Lewis. I just ran the VIN number and it's and the response comes back. It's not insured or registered. It's only titled to Mr. Lewis. There's no valid plate. I'm looking at it right now. Okay. That car been gone. That the police took oh, that yeah. car. Listen, if you blur out one more time, then you're gonna leave the courtroom. Show me the documentation that you have again, sir, please. Uh, yeah, he, he came by yesterday. He had a new car. I, I know. I just want to see it. I want to okay. see. I didn't, that's, that's why I'm asking. All right. That's a 2015 Dodge. That's why I said it looks good. I'm not concerned about the uh, the I'm not concerned about the uh, year or which car it is. Um, as long as he has registration on a vehicle. And he, and he, hold the insurance up one more time, please. Sir. I, I'm, I'm satisfied with that. I saw it already. So um, we'll move We'll move forward. Does he want to take the plea or what does he want to do, Mr. Moore? Yes, Your Honor. Can you, raise, can, you, can you raise your right hand, please, Mr. Lewis? Do you swear or affirm to tell the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth? Yes, sir. Are you put your hand down? You understand the maximum possible penalty for this offense is 93 days in jail and or $500 in fines? Yes, sir. You understand you have an absolute right to a trial? Yes, sir. Mr. Moore went over your other advice or rights in the breakout room, did he not? Yes, sir. You understood those rights? Yes, sir. Do you have any questions about those rights? No, sir. You know by taking this deal, you're going to give those rights up? Yes, sir. Has anybody offered you anything other than what's been stated in the record? No, sir. Let me draw your attention back to March the 22nd, 2023, at around 4.02 p.m., city of Detroit, in the area of Schaefer and Grand River. Did you have an occasion on that day to come in contact with the Detroit Police Department? Yes, sir. Were you operating a motor vehicle? Yes, sir. 
Um, did that officer ask you to produce a valid driver's a valid driver's license? Yes, sir. You could not do so, could you? No, sir. Why is that? Uh, as as when he ran the plate, I mean, when he ran my license, it came back suspended. That's when I found out that I had a suspended license out of Florida. That that triggered all the. So you were you were driving on a suspended license, is that correct? Yes, sir. Very well. I'm going to find your client guilty of the amended count of failure to display. Uh, That's still, fine. Pause. I'm going to dismiss the other matters. Mr. Can I get that stipulation of probable cause? Dismiss the it's other so matters. stipulated. Yes, so stipulated. All right. Dismissing the other matters. $240. When can you pay, sir? He's requested 30 days because uh, he, he's on strike. All right, very well. Um, I'm going to give you until November the 6th, 2023 to pay it. Pay it at any div that kiosk in the city of Detroit or come on down to the courthouse and pay it. I'm told you can upload that div that app to your phone. If you don't have anything further, sir, I wish you the best of luck. Have a very good day. Thank, thank you, you your, Thank you, Your uh, Honor. And I hope we don't have you. to come back. I, 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 <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> All right. Best of luck to you, sir. All right. Thank you. Well, it looks like this particular man learned it doesn't pay to be a sovereign citizen. And, well, he still has all these fines to pay because of his stupidity. But, hey, at least he's a recovering sovereign citizen. That's something anyway. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one.